Oh my god, hello. Oh, there's a Palovia. Oh, I thought that was a Phyla. Man, that was terrifying. That actually got my heart pumping a little bit. I'm not gonna lie. Hey everyone, welcome back to another episode of Ark Survival Evolved. So today we are going to be hunting down another Baryonyx because um, obviously we lost one a couple of episodes back and we really need to get ourselves um, another one because that will really help us out in the caves which we need to start running the caves more often so we can get artifacts and so we can do the bosses um, and yeah, Baryonyx is going to be really helpful with that. Uh, really, I do want to craft that, but a 404% one ain't that bad. So I think we're going to just take that one out with us until this breaks, really. Um, we want some basic kibble. Not basic, regular kibble. I knew it was the blue one, I just couldn't remember what it was called. What was it? What was it? Regular kibble. Yeah, so we need some regular kibble. Take a bunch of darts with us as well. I'm hoping that with the upgraded rifle, I'm not really going to need to use that many darts on it anyway. Um, we're going to try finding one in the swamp area that's a bit closer to our base so we can bring it back here and put it in our pen and then tame it that way. Uh, ideally, I want to find a male and a female so that I can breed them, as I said in the last episode. Um, I also might go out and try and find another RG, because it is nice to have one that's got some levels in weight. This one was literally just made for killing stuff, so if I need to take a bunch of resources or building materials or anything anywhere, it, this just doesn't work. So um, This is going to be a bit of a taming episode, and hopefully we'll get something decent out of it. We actually forgot to bring a spyglass with us so I just landed on top of my base and I'm hoping we're close enough to pull and we are so let's get one of those crafted and then we'll head back out and try and find a baryonyx. We found one over here it's only level 12 so, because it was night time and it's kind of hard to try and find anything in the swamp biome uh, at night, I've come over to one of the mountains where there was a load of RGs. There doesn't seem to be as many as there were in like previous episodes and stuff, but I'm trying to see if we can find an RG that we can tame rather than trying to get a... Baryonyx and then when it gets to daytime then we'll try getting the Baryonyx and hopefully that'll be a bit easier like, I'm sure there was like loads of RGs around here before this is like where we tamed the Giga and I'm positive there was loads of them flying around let's just start killing stuff so hopefully more will spawn in there's one there oh yeah 92 still I don't really want be honest. That one's dead. Oh no, he took it. Okay, it's fine. Don't seem to be having much luck. Oh, there's another one there actually. What are you? Oh, you're 16. Are you both 16? So we have that one which is coming for us now. Okay, there's a couple here. Okay, yeah, so you're 16. There is another one there. Yeah, it's only at level 88. I would prefer higher. There's a couple around here. Where have they gone? I'm sure there was another one in this area. Or in this direction. 
So, ah, there it is, between those rocks. So let's go over here. For you, 96. Maybe we'll go for the level 96. What are you? Level 20. This is the 96. But it's male. I'm sure that's what this one is. This is a male. Uh, I kind of want to. I don't know. Oh, where are you going? Press the wrong button. Oh! No way! Man, that does lots of tall pour then. Because that was a level 96. Although I have to say, I don't know what kibble that has, so I don't really want to risk using regular kibble. Yeah, 4k tall pour in two shots, that's mad. I actually bought like gateways and gates of me so I could do one of the traps, one of my usual traps, but it looks like I don't need that. <coughs> well, let's. Oh, that's going to take a while anyway, so let's have a little scout. I'm hoping it will actually stay asleep long enough. I've just realised I don't have any narcotics, do I? No. Oh my god, there's a level 116. And you're female. And you're female. Let's go. Uh, that didn't help at all. Whoops. Stop bobbing and weaving. Don't worry, buddy, you can take it. But I know for a fact you can. Oh my god, two shots again. 4.7k. I wonder how much torpor this actually does then. Because that's crazy amounts. I'm hoping you have some prime meat on you. And that you do. I figured you would. I'm really hoping you're not going to be an issue. But just in case. Not really got any level of protection here. So I'm literally just going to stay here and wait for this one to tame up because I do really want this one. Alright, one of the RGs is just finished taming up. Um, this was the lower level one that's just finished and the other one is pretty close it just needs to eat one more time and then we should be good on that that is pretty good that I don't actually need to use a trap ooh there's another one over there what are you oh okay we got the other one uh, where'd it go it's there that's not even the one that I saw. Okay, whatever. Hello. 173. Awesome. Uh, sorry, I don't really even know what is decent stats on an RG. Um, but yeah, I reckon I'm match. Oh no, I didn't mean to do that. 
before I put you back up. I thought I had the other one in my hand. Um, yeah, I'm definitely going to start mutating Argies as well. So I'm going to breed these three together and try and figure out what my base pair is going to be. Because obviously I don't know what the base stats on this one were. Um, I can't even remember what episode this was even tamed in because it wasn't in the RG taming episode that I did because I think we lost that one and this one was acquired a little bit later on. Um, so yeah, I don't really know. I'm just going to have to breed them a few times uh, to figure out because it's sort of like level based and you'll get like a a highest sort of possible level without a mutation so I just need to keep breeding until I figure out what that is and then we'll start going for the mutations and there's an alpha raptor down there hello sir come to me please why are you just running in circles come to me please Oh, where are you going? Man, you're so fast. Like, oh, I ain't even. There's no way I'm catching up with you. Come back. Fight me, please. Hello. Oh, go away. Come on. Are you actually for real? There you go. There you go. Come on. Get some. See, this is more like it, just running into my attacks. That's what we want. That's what we need from you. Oh, go away. What are you doing? There we go. No, I haven't got anything decent out of that. Nope, I got some arrows. Awesome. Just my luck. So he came back over to the Redwoods going sort of over towards sort of like the border of the redwoods and the swamps and of course it gets foggy like we're not destined to get another baryonyx are we it just doesn't want to happen I'm hoping at some point we'll find like another uh, filer um, so we can get some claws I'm hoping to see some spinos along the way as well because we need some more of those oh, I'm just randomly hitting stuff where even am I? okay probably should just cross Oh my god, hello. Oh, there's a Pelovia. Oh, I thought that was a Phyla. Man, that was terrifying. That actually got my heart pumping a little bit. I'm not going to lie. Oh, it's actually so annoying. Why is it so foggy? Right, I think the fog is kind of clearing a little bit now. I'm not squinting my eyes so much at least which is a positive sign now we're just on the hunt for a baryonyx you know I've been flying around I've not really seen much of anything one thing I've seen loads of is a load of dialos and apart from these two parasas I found one snake. I've not seen any frogs. I've not seen any crocs. Oh, and speak of a frog, there's one which I completely missed the grab on it. But where are the berries? Okay, so as soon as I'm moaning about frogs, there's loads of frogs now. 
Oh, Baryonyx. They're only level 16. Err. Never mind. What is that? There's something big over here. Oh, it's just a Sarko. Well, there's a Capro as well, but the Sarko is what I was looking at. That's what I saw. Oh. Got another one there. Level 32. I'm pretty sure the other one that I had wasn't a particular actually no I think it was like a level hundred at least I'm hoping you're not deep enough water to stun it's fine because you didn't even get a chance there's a Sarko over here oh there'll be an explorer note there Didn't actually give me anything though. I don't know if I've just come in a circle or if there's going to be another explorer note here. No, I've just come in a circle. This is the one that I just got. Oh no, what level are you? You're only level 4. Okay. I actually went to attack a frog and then I caught that by mistake. But it's not one that we want anyway. Oh, we found one. Oh, we found one. Uh, yep, yeah, cool. We got it. We got it. We got it. Oh, okay. I thought I just dropped it then. Uh, where do I need to go? Wait, where do I need to go? Quick, quick, quick. Oh, wait. I'm actually like really close to my base as well. Right, how many shots is this going to take? I wonder if you've got more or less teleport than a... than an RG. Ah, we made it to the trap. Safe and sound. And he's in. And easy works. Hey, buddy. Oh, okay, you can hit me. Damn, two shots again, even for that. Let's just bring the RG down so I don't have to go climbing up the ladder to go and get it later. Why are you not on automatic anyway? weird. Right, easy tames. Because we got kibble. I imagine it's only probably going to take one or two kibble. Yeah, it's only going to take two kibble to get that fully tamed. 70% in one eat. Not too shabby. There we go, it's all tamed up. We'll take that kibble back, thank you very much. You can just eat from the trough. And by eat from the trough, I mean I'm going to cryopod you. But not for long, because I'm going to release... Actually, no, I'm not. Not yet, anyway. Yeah, I accidentally released both my Argies at the same time, so this one's currently cryo-sick. Sad, sad times. 
Right, to save some time on the episode, we went out and we got ourselves another Baryonyx. It wasn't as good as the other ones, there's no point really showing the sort of like capture with the RG and bringing it back and whatever. It was just level 108 and it's a male, so we went for it. It's still pretty high level, so it's nothing to sort of scoff at or anything like that, but yeah, we'll go with that. We'll rock that. Level 108 is fine. Hey, there we go. That's where you ended up at. 161. Not too bad at all. We've got the other one over here. The RG is still down. I've started feeding it some stimulants, but it's still slow going. I've probably done about 150 stimulants so far. Um, but yeah, it's slow going. But what we're going to do is we're going to start getting these mating and we're going to start a mating line of Baryonyxes. Is, is, e, Multiple Baryonyx. I don't know why I kind of said about starting the breeding line of the Baryonyx and left it there as if we was going to continue the episode. We're not actually continuing the episode. Breeding takes absolutely ages. I mean, it took me almost, well, probably around or over two months to get the Rexes fully mutated in two stats. So, yeah, I'm definitely not going to be showing any of that in this episode. Just know that they're getting bred. I'm just sort of breeding them to get the base pair that I need to start um, and then this 172 I'm probably just gonna level up a little bit so that we can start getting it in the caves and um, yeah so we can start getting the artifacts back and start doing the bosses building up some elements so we can start getting some tech stuff and then we'll work our way up from there but that's going to be it for this episode, so if you did enjoy, don't forget to drop a like and subscribe to the channel if you're new. Until next time, see you later.